Welcome students. In this video, I'm going to solve the following integral. Zero to pi. of sine x cos x dx okay so for this we're gonna be using the double angle identity first that says that sine of 2x is equal to 2 sine x cos x so using this identity we can rewrite uh, the, the integral by, by substituting this with uh, with this because we can say that uh, we can divide this identity by 2 and 2 so this cancel and we say that sine of x cosine x is equal to sine of 2x over 2 and we can pull that uh, one half out out of the integral so we can say that 0 to pi of sine x cosine x dx is equal to one half zero to pi of sine two x dx So right now we're at the point of 0 to pi 1 half sine of 2x dx Here we can use a u substitution And we let u equal to 2x So du is equal to du is equal to 2 dx now we solve uh, dx uh, here and we let uh, 1 half du is equal to dx So now we're gonna we're gonna turn the the integral from dx to du. One way to do it is to substitute. Uh, so dx is one half du. Okay, so we're gonna do one half, and then we know that u uh, x goes from. We need to solve u for to change the. The, to change the from from x to u we need to change 0 to pi into into u ranges so for so for for example uh, when x is equal to 0 u is equal to 2 times 0 which is 0 and when x is equal to pi u is equal to 2 times pi which is equal to 2 pi that means that the, the integral now it goes from 0 
to 2 pi and then we have 1 half uh, for dx and then uh, and then we have sine of u du because dx is equal to one half du so one half and du and then sine 2x becomes sine of u because we, we did a u substitution and then we pull out the one half which is equal to one fourth zero to two pi sine of u du the integral of sine u is equal to negative cos u that means that this is equal to one fourth and then negative cos u from zero to two pi I mean that this is equal to negative one fourth and then cos of 2 pi minus cos of 0 which is equal to negative 1 fourth cos of 2 pi is equal to 1 and cos of 0 is equal to 1 that means that negative one fourth one minus one is zero so times zero is equal to zero and that's our answer so what this tells us is that the integral from zero to pi of sine x cos x dx is equal to zero thank you very much don't forget to subscribe